Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The Microsoft News and Interests feed, also known as the Taskbar widget, is apparently rolling out to more people worldwide at present, and the Taskbar widget, or News and Interests feed, first started rolling out in April of this year, 2021, on a controlled rollout, and not everybody started seeing it at first, including myself. Now, with this month, um, the May 2021 Patch Tuesday Cumulative Update, KB5003173, the um, taskbar widgets started rolling out to a lot more users of Windows 10 with that update, and I also received my taskbar widget with KB5003173. Now, Microsoft says at the moment that if you haven't seen it yet, obviously it's on a controlled rollout, but one of the reasons could be that your Windows 10 operating system is not fully up to date. So if you haven't received it yet, just then, you know, make sure that your Windows operating system has got all the updates, relevant updates. And then, you know, obviously I mentioned it's on a controlled rollout. So not everybody, you know, will see it just yet. So just be patient if you haven't received it yet. I'm sure that you will be getting it in the not too distant future. Now the news and interest feed is a quite a handy little feature I found. And if you just hover over it, you get your you know your latest news, you get your top stories, you can click on the weather, it will just direct you to Microsoft Edge where you can get an in-depth weather forecast. You know it has some other little options where um, you you know you can obviously interact, you can edit location, hide the card, there's more settings, you know you can you can X out of articles if you're not interested in them, you can interact. So you can um, like an article, you can put emojis there, you know, you can save it as a bookmark to read later and so on. And I find that in my workflow, it's actually quite handy because I just hover over it and I have what I want right there, my weather especially, and obviously topics of interest that are in my news feed. Now, apparently though, you know, although it is a handy feature, there are a couple of problems. And there are at least three problems that have been reported with the taskbar widget. And the first one is that there are some user reports that some say that the icon looks a little bit blurry on the taskbar. Now, I don't really agree with that. I think it looks fine. But some users say that compared to other um, taskbar icons, it looks a little bit blurry in contrast. So that is the first one. And then the next is that it only... The next problem is that it only displays on your taskbar if your taskbar is at the bottom of your screen. So if I just right click and go to taskbar settings and I change the location of my taskbar and I'm going to put it to the left of my screen, you can see now that the news and interests feed does not display in my taskbar. So that is obviously a bug that Microsoft will have to iron out. So it only works when your taskbar is at the bottom of your screen at present. And then the third problem, which is also a little bug that will obviously have to be fixed by Microsoft, is that um, the you know your taskbar feed can stop working and display a blank window when it is loading with no animation. So you know it will just have basically a blank white window. There will be no animation or feed, and that is obviously a problem that will have to be sorted out. But according to Microsoft, there is a quick fix for this if you are experiencing that. And what you will have to do if you are getting a blank window when you open your news and interest feed is what you have to do is just go right click on your taskbar again, go to task manager. And then what we do is we go right down to the bottom to file Windows Explorer. There we can see we go to Windows Explorer. All we do if we right click on it and we go restart Windows Explorer and according to Microsoft that will solve the problem of having a blank window when your news and interest feed loads. So that's just a quick simple solution but obviously that is a bug that will have to be sorted out in the long term. And then just to end off, you know, if you don't like the look of it there, you can always just right click on your taskbar and go to news and interests and you can show icon only. And you can also turn the feature off completely if you don't like it. I like it, so I'm going to leave it there because the novelty hasn't worn off. So that's just an update regarding the um, news and interest feed. If you haven't received it, make sure 
that your Windows 10 operating system is up to date. And then obviously, um, you know, there are three, a couple of bugs that have been reported, which I've just, you know, um, demonstrated. And then, you know, just be patient if you haven't received it, because it is on a controlled rollout. And I'm sure you will not be, get, you know, you will be getting it in the not too distant future. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.